hello guys welcome back to my channel again and this is Mukesh Kumar and today I'm gonna show you how to implement search bar in the table view controller so for that you first need to download the table view controller project and this is the URL of the video table view controller in this description I can download the complete Xcode project of table view controller. I will share this link in the description of this video. So just click on this. You can download it from here. So this is the desktop path where I am saving this project. And just go back. This is my file which is I have just downloaded. Just double click on this and open up this folder, open this Xcode project, click on open. So this is our table view controller project and now I am going to add search bar tool in this table view controller. So from object library I can search the search bar and drag it to here like so right and then I need to create property for this search bar so just click on this assistant editor and let me minimize this font size like so looks better and in dot h file I will declare the property of this search bar drag and drop using control key and name it as search bar click connect just close it from here and go to dot h file and this is the property which I have just declared here I need one delegate protocol that is UI search bar delegate this is defined because some of the predefined functions or the methods will be needed later so now just go to m file and here in the interface block i need to declare two variables one is ns mutable array and name i'm taking the free tooled devices and next is bool type variable name is is filtered so basically this filtered devices I've taken because when the search bar will search any of the values so that filtered items will be added in this filter devices and if there is searching then this value will be true otherwise by default it will be false so in this view did load method I will declare is filtered variable to default value that is false and next I'm connecting that delegate of search bar to self like so now you can delete this method because there is no enough it and here i will include that predefined method of that delegate protocol and the name is text did change yeah this one in this i will put up a if condition and if search text this parameter name search text dot length is equals to equals to zero means there will be no character to search so in this case the is filtered tag will be false and in, in the else part is filtered will be true and filtered array should be initialized and it's array lock 
in it like so and I will use the foreign loop because this is the default array I have and on the basis of search the filtered items will be added into some variable so the variable name I'm taking is NS string and the name will be device and the collection the device is array in this statement I'm taking NS range type variable name range the name of the variable and in this device range of a string the options in the range of string will be search text and options is ns case insensitive search where the case doesn't matter right in sorry the range variable no asterisk sign will be there and now again I'm using the if condition for this name range if name range dot locate location is not equals to ns form ns not form means everything is okay in this case I will add the objects into my mutable array so the filter device is add object method and add from device variable like so right and now the number of rows and sections is written in devices dot count means the items present in this array will be written as number of rows but if there is a search then I'm using the if condition means is if if is filtered is true so in this case you need to return filter devices array dot count right and in this case also cell for word index part method I'm using the same if condition if is filtered is true then the filter device will be shown so I'm just copying and paste changing the name of array that is filter devices and this will be in the else part like so so this is the complete code for the search bar with table view controller and now you can run the program to test your application so this is our project in the simulator now I'm clicking on this search bar and I'm searching like IW one thing I forgot to add to reload my table so scroll back itself dot table view reload data so this line should be added in this search bar method and I outside the if else part now just run it again and see the output Now I'm um, clicking on this search bar and entering some characters like iPhone. So IP means that TV and iWatch is disappeared. Like I will write IW means iWatch and iPad so iPad only, iTV then iTV only. So this is how the search bar is working in this table view so thank you guys thank you for watching this video i hope this is very helpful to you and if you like this video so don't forget to hit like button and subscribe my channel and to read about the search bar in the table view controller you can visit my blog on the same topic 
as mentioned in the description below till then bye bye see you in the next video wherever i go wherever i see i'll remember you if you remember